Hi, I'm Jared from FNS Yamaha, and today I'll be showing you the 2020 Bennington 23 SSBXP Swingback Pontoon Boat. This boat will come with all the features I will show and go over with you here today. Beginning in the back of the boat, we have our 250 horsepower Yamaha SHO VMAX engine. This boat currently sits on three pontoons, hence the Tritune name. This boat also features the SPS package, which includes sealed lifting strakes, an underdeck wave shield, and hydraulic steering with the power steering option. This Shorelander galvanized trailer includes aluminum mags and hydraulic brakes on both axles. Along with the trailer, quick slide bunks, we have also added inner pontoon guides. In the front of the trailer, we have a spare tire mount, as well as convenient boarding ladder attached to the winch stand. Moving to the boat itself, the exterior of the boat is Monaco blue with a metallic silver accent. In the front, we have LED docking lights and a stainless steel housing. This provides better visibility at night, pulling the boat on and off the trailer. Moving up inside the boat now, on the front, you can see the heavy duty rub rail all the way around the boat. The flooring of this boat is a beige seagrass vinyl flooring. The interior of this boat is platinum in color, and the seats feature an 80% cutout with horizontal diamond press stitching. Inside the boat, all of the seats that you can see here do open up for storage underneath, including the side recliner. It's worth noting that the speakers to this boat have been upgraded. We have a similar layout on the opposite side. Here you can see a portable cup holder, which can be easily picked up and moved anywhere throughout the boat. These seats over here also open up for additional storage underneath as well. In this front seat, there's an inboard seat cooler. Moving back, in the floor, we have floor storage. This is in the center pontoon of the boat. It can hold large objects for water sports, such as water skis or wakeboards. Moving back, on the side of the helm, we have a compartment for storage. Just above that, we have an interior light. The helm is elevated as part of the package for this boat. Above us, we currently have the bimini top extended for the boat. This will provide 10 feet of shade over top of the boat. In the bimini itself, we have blue ice LED accent lighting. Onto the helm. On the dash, we have three gauges. We have the trim, tachometer, and fuel gauge for the boat as well as any accessory switches you might need when you're out in the water. To the left of our steering wheel, we have our upgraded Rockford stereo system. Next to that, we have the audio and USB input for that stereo system. And just beneath that, we have the 12 volt accessory outlet. The steering wheel does have tilt. On the right side, we have the side mount controls for your Yamaha outboard. And beneath that, we have the ignition. The helm chair does have both reclining and swivel features. Moving back now to the swing back portion of the boat. Just in front of that though, we have more seating. Again, it opens up for storage underneath. Currently in this section, we have the boot, which will cover the bimini when it's not in use. Here we have our rectangular table, which can be removed if desired. Here's the swing back portion of the boat. 
It is currently in the lounge position. However, it can be easily moved to accommodate more seating. Underneath is the swing back. We have a storage area. Currently we are storing the mooring cover for the boat, which will keep the boat protected when it's not in use. In the back, we have the fuse box for the boat, as well as the battery on off switch. Here we have the mounting bracket for a privacy enclosure. This can serve as a changing room. In the back of the boat, we have our 54 inch ski pylon. We also have a curved boarding ladder for easy access in and out of the water. This boat has a 12 person maximum capacity and is currently on sale at FNS Yamaha Marine.